Hey everybody, it's Rory from ANS Gear, and we've got something everybody's been waiting to see today. This is the brand new MG100 Power Stock. So this is the stock that goes on the MG100 that incorporates the tank into the bottom of the stock, and it looks and feels fabulous. So let's go ahead and get it open and check it out. So inside you're going to get your stock, which is right here, and then you're going to get your tube your buffer tube for your stock setup right there. Now this one has a little screw floating around in the bottom of it. I would assume that it goes to this one right here. Right there. It looks like that one fell out. So let's put that one back in place. Right there. So it's gonna go on the back here. This setup is so nice because you don't need to even use any of the adapters that come with the MG100. The MG100 has a whole bunch of things where you can put a drop stock or no stock or stock straight out the back. You don't need to use any of those things. You're just gonna pull out the plug or whatever you're using in there already, whether it be this blanking plug or whether it be the drop stock setup. Slide this one in. And then lock it down. And you're, you're already set up on there to hook this thing up. Now, you need a tank. Dun, dun, dun. So this is just a 13 cubic inch, 3000 PSI tank. If you look at the outside of the box here, it says to fit HPA tanks maximum 51 millimeters or two inches in diameter. So this 13, 3000 right here, it is, there's not a lot of room for slop inside there. So this size bottle in width or diameter is the max that you're gonna see. Now you can find them that are a little bit longer maybe and give you a little bit more space. It's gonna uh, affect how far the stock can move back and forth. But as long as it can slide inside there, you're gonna be able to use it. So let's go ahead and throw one of these on so you can check it out. Make sure that there's no air in this thing. No, there isn't. Perfect, perfect. I'm gonna put this all the way on there. Line this up, look at that, like a thing of beauty. We're gonna pull that down so that the stock can get on there. If you just push from the back right here, you won't be able to pull the locking bar down far enough to snap on. So you wanna get it from the front and pull it down extra far. That allows the, the bar to clear the tube and be able to get underneath it and lock on. So now that we've done that, we can move that all the way around. If we had a longer uh, tank on here, then we wouldn't be able to come all the way to the number one position. We might only make it to like the five position right there, depending on how long our tank was in there. But this, I mean, technically you could, you could throw a tank on here that was this long, turning it all the way up to 11 on the positionometer right here, but you could never collapse it down. And that's a really long setup right there. But it is possible to throw that tank size in there if it is that 51 millimeter or two inch diameter maximum, because that's all that this stock can fit. But for me, that little setup right there is perfect. Actually, we can come out maybe, maybe to three. There we go. That feels great in my hands right there. It looks good. It incorporates the whole thing into it. It puts a nice firm uh, shoulder rest in there. So you can really push it into your shoulder and really feel comfortable sling mount on there, Planet Eclipse quality. You know that this thing is gonna last forever. It's not gonna fail on you. I highly, highly recommend picking one of these up if you are running the MG100 with this uh, kind of bottle setup on there. It looks and feels fantastic. We've got them in stock. Power stocks for the MG100 from Planet Eclipse. Get it at ansgear.com.